A sign on the Dollar Tree store in St. Francis Monday morning said this Dollar Tree will be closed until further notice. All the workers quit and we must restaff. Are you surprised the store is locked up in the middle of the day? Yeah, yeah, exactly. This, uh, this is the one I always come to. And apparently they can't find workers. That's sad, really sad. The sign that's now on the Dollar Tree door says they're open 9 in the morning till 6 at night, but the door is locked, no one's answering the phone, even the FedEx driver couldn't make a delivery. We watch customer after customer walk up to locked doors. Unfortunately, I, I believe it's going to be happening more. Um, Dollar Tree customer Maria Camacho says child care is part of the challenge. She's taking care of her grandchildren so her son can work. It's really hard when you can't find good workers nowadays in the stores. Um, nobody wants to work. But what existed long before this pandemic still exists today, and that is a shortage of workers in our state and our country. Governor Tony Evers unveiled a worker creation program Tuesday at Gateway Technical College in Kenosha. The state is partnering with schools around the state to train people to fill jobs. Cindine Jennings is dean of a program that helps young people get back on track, earn a diploma, and get to work. Individuals that are out there applying for jobs, what's one of the first questions you get asked on an application? Do you have your high school credential? It's one fix to what's now a long-term problem. Terry Sater, WISN 12 News. The state is dedicating $130 million over the next three years for partnerships with Wisconsin technical schools and colleges to train workers and help start businesses.